Hi folks, this is Shine from Heybooster. As you know, Google PMX campaigns promise an AI-driven approach to advertising by automating tasks such as keyword bidding. While this sounds perfect, in theory, many advertisers discover that AI cannot capture every detail of the businesses. This often leads to overspending on irrelevant search. The good thing is that Google has announced it will increase the negative keyword limit to 10,000. Adding negative keywords can significantly optimize where your ad appears. There are two primary reasons why a well-structured negative keyword strategy can address these issues. The first reason, PMAX targets irrelevant keywords for your businesses. AI optimized based on historical data, it doesn't truly really understand your business model or audience behavior on a human level. It may initially allocate budget to irrelevant keywords until it learns they don't convert. For example, if you are selling luxury products, you are generally don't want your ads to show a free keywords. Google often won't recognize the mismatch between luxury and free until you spend the money on these keywords and observe poor performance resulting in wasted budget. But also, you can train the algorithms by excluding these irrelevant keywords with your businesses. The second reason is PMX target your brand keywords at high CPC. For sure, your brand keywords have high conversion rate. However, your brand terms can spend your budget by themselves, and there is no resource for non-branded growth focus keywords. When you separate brand and non-brand keywords, you will have more flexibility in settings, different goals and strategies. We suggest you create a separate campaign to isolate branded keywords as a negative keywords. I hope you enjoyed this video. We are building a community. It includes the best use cases around the PPC masterclass. So I put the link in the description that you can sign up for free. Hope to see you there for now.